sometimes projects start off to be simple ones and somehow they pick up speed and start to grow legs and run away, I don't know. Uh, I started out to make a video about making an ornament. Now, all of those up there, those are all videos about making each part of that ornament. Except for that one over in the corner there, that's the, uh, the one about the choosing of the wood. Um, choosing and the cutting and the drilling and the pre preparation kind of stuff. The base here is a piece of alder. Now, it's been in my shop for a couple of years. I used the another part of it for something else. I think I used it for a base for something else. And, now, that side I made nice and smooth. And this side, I, uh, I went over with my quarter inch detail gouge quite a long ways over the, the tool rest and it caused the chatter in there which was kind of cool. Put some felt pan on it to add to it and, and this here is, is one of those cheap dollar store magnets that uh, another magnet would stick to it. <laughs> um, The wire here, the reason for this being like this is because I have that much wire and I want to go to there. So that seemed to be the best way to do it as far as I could tell. And it looks kind of out there. Um, uh, the ornament itself, if I lay it flat like that, the lights go out. They back up, they go on. But also if I twist it off, they go off. Because you see, I have the pop bottle lid in there. And I have the pop bottle neck glued to the top here. And then a hole drilled down and through. And through that hole, I've got the wires. with a negative wire with, its, with a washer soldered onto it, laying on the bottom the negative side of the battery down. A piece of paper up the side here to protect the side of the battery from making contact too soon. And, uh, well, when you put the, the lid on, it pushes the, the washer down into the battery, which, which makes contact. And, uh, well, if I had thread tracing tools, that would be a, a perfect place to, to try that out. It sure makes a handy little switch. Maybe not to uh, the highest of tech, but hey. down there in the corner. You, you give them all the credit that they deserve because they deserve a whole bunch. This ornament, the challenge that they've put on for the fourth year in a row, they've done an excellent job. Well done Carl, well done Helen. Um, if, you, if you click on that, to that picture down there, it'll take you to the playlist of all the ornaments that were made this year. Oh, and, and if you click on the stump here, it'll tell you the story of how it became what it is. I hope your holiday seasons go well. And uh, I want to thank you all for watching. And I really do hope to see you all here again next time. Bye for now.